because I could not be more proud of a group of young people in terms of what they've been able to overcome um, and, and still be able to come away um, with their, their sixth straight winning season when a lot of people counted them out when Jen Kaida went down. Since Jen went down, they are 16 and eight, and I could not be more proud of a group of young people than I am this group. You, you see that in, in Britt coming off of her fourth knee surgery, being out all summer long and not being cleared to practice until um, the first week of, of December. Um, and for her to go through that just so she could be part of the conference season with her teammates says a lot about her. <laughs> For AJ to step into the, the role that she had to step into and go from playing 10 to 12 minutes to playing 25 to 35 and being able to do what she did in terms of rebounding and defending is, is incredible. And then you add Amber Sorensen in the mix as well. It's going to give us added experience and depth um, at those positions and it's going to be um, a fight in terms of, of those starting positions next year. And we're looking forward uh, to the competitiveness we're going to have in practice if everyone's healthy. This year's meant a lot. Um, my whole career, just being a student athlete at UNI, um, we have gone through a lot this year, and we've had a lot of injuries, and we've had a lot of chances to just give up and decide this isn't our year. Um, let's look forward to the future. And I'm extremely proud to play with the people that I have played with this year and in the past. And it's been a fun season. And I, you know, there's nothing that I would necessarily change about it because we learned a lot and I know that a lot of the players have grown um, as basketball players and just matured as who they are. <laughs>